Yeah, H- Hogan family theme. And and last week we watched the Valerie theme. And, uh, and of course, uh, a shout out to the uh, Post Rhetoric podcast. Yes. Um, I, I, f- I, forget, I forget the name of the guy, but he made a video with the cross of the Sopranos theme on, on the Valerie video. Yeah. And the Valerie theme on the Sopranos video. And I almost died <laughs> because it was it was honestly like the funniest thing I've I've, I've probably ever seen. <laughs> I I've gotta say the Sopranos one on the Valerie video was a little bit better, um, but the Sopranos uh, with, with Tony driving to the Hogan family <laughs> that well, was I very think, funny as well. I think the reason I said to you that I thought it was the Valerie one was so good is because at one point there's the scene where. It, 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 the the husband's coming back on the plane and it yeah. happens to coincide perfectly when when like there's the there's the scene in the sopranos opening where the plane flies over so both both songs had the plane flying over perfectly <laughs> yes woke up so, this morning and you got your silver gun <laughs> you know what was really funny is that um so one of the one of the people that follows us on twitter Mm-hmm. Uh, post rhetoric podcast. Oh yeah. He, he wrote to me and he said, "I counted seven husses, four before he talked and three after." And I wrote back and I went, "And yet he still screwed me." Well, yeah, it, it the over under be... was seven and a half. <laughs> it's kind of like when the girl points out after Phil's speech, "You wear a tutu," and uh, th- that's in modern. In ballet, you wear a tutu. It doesn't matter. <laughs> no, it doesn't. <laughs> 